strange bedfellow since the first campaign songs began influencing voters. Traditionally, at convention time, recording stars are invited to do the national anthem, as the Queen of Soul will do tomorrow night at the Democratic Convention here in New York. Aretha Franklin, how you been? Fine, thanks. Huh? Thank Haven't you. seen you in a while. It's been a little while, I guess. Yeah. Every, I think most people know you don't fly, right? Don't, like, don't uh, enjoy flying. No. Yeah. How'd you, get, how'd you wind up here from Detroit? Custom bus. Custom bus? Mm-hmm. Nice trip down? Wonderful. All went, all went Wonderful. well? Wonderful. You, this, is it true that you were asked to sing the anthem at the 88 convention? 88? Yeah, down in Atlanta. No. No? no? That was the rumor. Uh, no, I was invited, but not to do the anthem, to do some, to participate in some other way. Yeah. Uh-huh. Oh, yes. Wait, 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 wait. Yes, I was. Reverend Jackson did ask. Oh, Reverend Jackson did ask you to come on down. Yes. You just couldn't work it into your schedule. That's right. How did these invitations come about? I mean, does somebody from the campaign call you up? Does, does Clinton call you directly? Did Ron Brown call you? How, how did the invite come this time around? I haven't had the pleasure of meeting Mr. Brown uh, or Clinton, but uh, sometimes through my agents, sometimes uh, personal friends. Yeah. And the like. The Star Spangled Banner is is neither an, an easy song to sing mm-hmm. or a typical Aretha tune. How does the prospect of doing it sit with you? I enjoy it. My sister said that. Irma said the same thing. Uh, what? She said I, I, she said what? She it's said, not an easy that's song? It's not an easy song to sing. Yes, it is. It is? Yes. Why? I mean Melodically you do... it just is. But, but and I don't know my music, okay? But supposedly it has such a range that no matter what key you begin in, mm-hmm. the lows are too low and the highs are too high. Mm-hmm. That's not true? No, because when you have range, you can go from one end of the spectrum to the other. So when you hit, or the land of the free, you don't necessarily go for a peak? You just kind of well, level it, it up? Well, it is a peak within the song. But if you have range, you make that peak. Yeah? Yeah. I guess I, I guess I couldn't ask you to do a little bit of it here. Huh? Oh, we don't want to do that. This huh? morning is no. too early. Do you have a choice when you're asked to do this kind of thing? Does, do they say, okay, if you'd like to, you can sing America the Beautiful instead? Uh-huh. I have a choice. I, I like the Star Spangled Banner better, and I like uh, uh, the Negro anthem. Lift every heart and voice Lift every and voice and sing. Yes. Mm-hmm. Will they allow you to do that? Um, I'm sure they At the would. convention tomorrow? You can sure ask them, will. can you? How political? Well, they've asked for the Star Spangled Band. Okay. So I yeah. honor that request. You'll, you'll be at the convention in an entertainment capacity. How politically minded would you say you are? I'm aware of the issues and the candidates and so on. Would you characterize yourself as a Clinton supporter? <laughs> I'm, yeah, I, I would vote for Clinton, yes. You would? Mm-hmm. Th- let's, let's talk about some other things. I, I, I want to roll in a, um, a video here that uh, since you won't sing for me right there, I want to roll in a video. This was taken at a, uh, at a party for Clive Davis, president of Arista Records, okay. your label. After we roll it, then you can tell me about it. Okay. Okay, let's roll it. Help me out, Buck. Mr. Davis, I want you to look at it. Look at it. And remember it. Because this is probably the first and last time that you will see me do this on stage. idea was that? It was mine. I've, uh, I know some ballet. I've studied ballet for uh, a number of years. Well, I started in New York when I lived here in the New yeah. York Academy of Ballet over on Madison Avenue. But being a singer, you never get a real chance to really get into it and uh, stay with it any length of time. Yeah. But um, natural woman tonight, the pas de deux, and tomorrow. Well, it's all right. Whatever becomes you. Um, what else are you working on these days? What else am I working on? Uh, HBO special coming up in uh, August. Yeah. My special guest will be Bonnie Raitt. And uh, contracts, paperwork. You got a Greatest Hits album you're working on, too, right mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes. Are there any goals left to conquer for you? Any, oh, absolutely. Any, like what? Movies. I'd love to do movies. Wait a minute. More movies. More movies? Yeah. Really? Uh-huh. You want to you wanna stop singing and move into acting? No. Uh, singing is my first love, but I do want to do more movies hmm. and uh, telefilms, things like that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Did you hear Katie's impression of you a little bit earlier? I heard that. What would you think? It was sweet. <laughs> <laughs> is that the same as well-intentioned? Uh, of course. Musically, what would you think of it? 
It was it was cute. It's nice. Sure. Just All nice. Right. You want to take us out with it? Would you like to? Natural. Would you? Um, what, me? Yeah. Oh, I can't keep it too. I'm not even close. Just saying, go ahead. Not me. Uh, you won't sing. It'd be sacrilegious to talk over you, sing over you. We're going to disappear for a moment. Okay. Come on back. Just, thank you. This is today.